Two years ago, SAP introduced Code Exchange as a code sharing platform for the SAP Community Network. But it's still hard to consume or contribute to another project. In April 2012, a team of SAP mentors and developers from the SAP Arborbin Eclipse team decided to fix this problem by building an Eclipse plugin which fully integrates Sublink into the new Eclipse-based ABAP development environment. Sublink is a project which allows you to easily transfer ABAP development objects from one system to another via a simple import-export mechanism. That makes Sublink the enabler of a distributed ABAP project on code exchange as they can use the central repository. Now we want to show you how easy it is to use a new Sublink plugin to consume or contribute to other projects on CodeExchange. I'm Gregor, a corporate consumer of CodeExchange projects. I found this DemoGem calculator project on CodeExchange and want to install it on my ABAP stack. To do that, I go to the expert view of the project and here I find a download link, which is a subversion repository. I've already set up this subversion repository here in Eclipse. I do a right click on the project team to update my local copy to the latest version. As I already had installed Sublink and the Sublink backend components, I can now do right click, Sublink and import this report into my backend system. The project is specified and I do a local object installation and finish. After the successful import, I can open the object. Sublink always imports inactive, so I have to activate this code and now I can run it. Let's see. Okay, I can do a division, execute, oh, a division by zero, a short dump. So it seems that I have to raise an issue on this code exchange the code exchange expert view, I find the issues tab. Here I can create a new issue. I will name it division by zero and in the content I put in diff causes dump. Okay, so somebody should take care about that. And let's create the issue. So the issue number four was created. Hi, I'm Graham. I'm the maintainer of this code exchange project, the DemoGem calculator. And I just got the notification. An issue was created by Gregor Wolf. Okay, let's have a look into the details. Here I see division by zero. Diff causes a dump. Okay, so I, as I'm the maintainer, I have the original coding here. Let's try it. Okay, let's try this. Okay, I really got this divide by zero. Now let's try to fix it. Here is a diff area. Okay, I directly do the calculation and forgot to move it into this else area where I do a check. Let's activate and run again. And the report now provides an error message. Okay, I can check this in. Do a right click, sublink. First, I export it to my local working copy. So the file exists already. I overwrite the export and click finish. Good. Here I have now a new version of the Slinky containing all the changes that I've done. And this has to be checked in into this project. Right click, team, commit and for a commit I have to provide a comment and I say I fixed the issue number four. Okay, so my job is done, the issue was corrected and let's hope the user is happy with my change. It's Gregor again. I got an email notification that the issue was fixed. So I will update my working copy here to the latest version and 
installs a Slinky again in my system with a right click, sublink, input into our project. I confirm and say I want to override the existing object. I open up this object and let's see, activate and execute. So when I run the division now, I get a nice error message. So this was easy. The sublink plugin for Ababin Eclipse significantly has lowered the learning curve for consuming and contributing to code exchange projects. Do everything from one integrated environment. And the best thing, you can start using it today also. Just go to our Eclipse update site, you put into Eclipse, the eclipse.sublink.org, and you can start using it now.